Today, we're jumping into Red Dead Redemption 2. Let's get into it. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do is come in here to desktop mode, and we're gonna come up into Cryo Utilities. We're gonna launch Cryo Utilities. We're going to click on, yes, we accept. Okay, let's type that password in. Okay, so we're gonna click on recommended. I have already done this, okay? So you're just gonna click on recommended and it's gonna set it for you, okay? Once you click on that, it says it can take up to 30 minutes. It shouldn't take that long because it's already been set. Okay, we're all done there. We're gonna close out of that. Okay, once that's done, we're going to head back into gaming mode. Okay, so here we are back in gaming mode. Uh, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna come over here to settings, okay? We're gonna scroll down to properties and uh, compatibility layers. As you can see, we're running on GE Proton 7-35. Okay, we're gonna come back out of here and we're gonna go ahead and launch the game. Okay, so here we are in the game. Um, we are going to go into settings. Come down to graphics. Okay, now as you can see, we're running at a resolution of 1280 by 720. We are windowed mode. Um, V-Sync is off, triple buffering on. I'm just gonna go ahead and just uh, scroll down these settings for you slowly. Way you guys can see them. Now these settings are also on our Facebook page with uh, pictures and whatnot. The link will be in the description below. You guys can follow us over there and uh, click on our uh, like and follow buttons where you'll be notified when we post new settings. Okay, there's our settings. Okay, now we're gonna back out. Now keep in mind, we are running at a UMA buffer of one gigabyte. There is a graphical um, glitch within this game. Uh, if we have it on four gigabytes of VRAM, um, there are graphical issues and it does not hold a perfect 30. So uh, with these settings that we have now, uh, we're set at um, Cryobytes recommended settings. A uh, big shout out to him for his contributions to the Steam Deck community. And um, we are running at a UMA buffer of one gigabyte okay so we're going to go ahead and launch this game okay here we are so as you guys can see um right now we're at 85 percent battery life uh we're sitting at uh, about two and a half hours it'll probably drop down to just over two hours um of battery life and uh so if we had a full charge we'd be sitting at about probably close to three hours of battery life um, for this game. I'm sitting at about half brightness for the sake of this video. Uh, so you can rest assured that if you have your, your brightness bumped up uh, quite a bit, that you're going to you know chew off probably a half an hour of that battery life um, alone. So what we're gonna do is we are going to put this overlay up top out of our way. And we're just going to play a little bit here. And uh, let's see here, let's see what weapons we got on the horse here. Um, I guess I don't have my rifle, but I mean, that's okay. Let's go. Now, one of the issues that really plagued this game after the last update, um, the update fixed the memory leak, um, but unfortunately it left us with a performance issue, a big hit when we got near bodies of water. Now, keep your eye on um, the uh, FPS here. We're sitting at 30 and that's in the river. Um, before, this uh, FPS would be tanking um, down into the low 20s um, or mid 20s every time you got near a body of water. And so uh, with these settings, we no longer have to worry um, about those uh, FPS spikes. And uh, we can just play the game at a dang near um, 
perfect 30 FPS. You may see little dips every now and then, but if you keep your eye on the, uh, the graph up there, um, you will see that it's a pretty solid flat line there. Now we had uh, another one of our subscribers um, request that we uh, put this performance overlay up so you guys can see what's going on, and we happily agreed. So uh, we wanna be as transparent as possible with all of our settings. Um, we work really hard to get these settings um, to a, a good place where you guys can feel confident that when you punch them in, you guys are gonna get the best experience possible. And uh, that's what we do at Pixel Deck. We make sure that uh, we're doing all the work so you don't have to. Um, we do have a Patreon if you guys wanna help uh, out what we do. Um, down in the link below, you can click on that and become a Patreon. Um, we do have uh, drawings um, from time to time. Um, as we get more Patreons uh, or patrons, we will be able to do that more often. So if you like what we do and you benefit from this channel, we would love your support. Okay, well, let's just roam around here a little bit. Um, we could go to the map and maybe start a quest. And uh, I won't play for too long, but enough to give you guys an idea of kind of what we're dealing with here. And uh, let's, uh, let's go over and see Mr. Robo here. Set our waypoint. And let's go check it out, make sure the focus is there. All right, you guys just keep your eye, keep your eye on that uh, yep. frame rate. I'm not getting involved in that right now. All I have is a six shooter on me and not very much ammo. As you can see, it's holding at a, a, a very steady 30 FPS, and it looks absolutely gorgeous. Um, we've ramped up as many settings as we could uh, while maintaining um, that smooth frame rate for you guys. And, uh, you know, one of the things um, we wanted when we purchased a uh, Steam Deck was to be able to play our games like the way we want to play them. And uh, with the Steam Deck, we have that opportunity. It has enough power uh, for us to have really amazing graphical fidelity on our games and still maintain just a solid um, uh, frame rate. As you can see, we're not having any issues around any of this water. We are just mowing right through it and that frame rate is locked. Okay, looks like we're getting real close here to where we need to be. And uh, let's see what we got here. Now, many of you probably remember this mission. Uh, this is our about a third playthrough uh, of this game. And uh, this has always been one of my favorite missions, my little uh, side missions here. Good, is good, is valuable, is, is very 
shovel, yes. I have your things, okay? I have anything in here or out there? Yes. Good? Not good yet. When I first did this mission, I actually really felt sorry for the guy. And, uh, yes, yes, but you know yes, what? If you yes. owe a debt, you gotta pay it. Okay. See, let me go through his whole house here. See if he says something. I could have swore that he was like covering up. Uh, what you got behind there? Here we go. Move aside. What do we have here? Moja obrączka, nie. Just keep quiet. Now he has a he has a horse out here in the stable, but uh, I don't want that horse uh, because I really really like this one. But he does have a horse in that stable you can take early on in the game if you need a good horse uh that horse is a solid acquisition okay Let's see if we can uh This game is so beautiful and uh, you know to be honest with you I actually enjoy playing this game more on the Steam Deck than I do on a big OLED 4k screen um, it just feels so good to play this in handheld and to just be relaxed in bed or or in your car waiting you know or at an appointment or uh, whatever else you guys know what I'm talking about with regards to you know being able to take your games portably wherever you go um, the Steam Deck makes it happen and um, I can honestly say this is probably my favorite purchase of last year. Um, it is just such an awesome, awesome gaming device. this off as a robbery anyway if you can get in that lockbox you can take what you want from it but ain't stealing if it's already stolen got that right old driscoll okay we'll loot this body and uh we'll check this uh 
I wonder if I can just shoot this. There we go. I'll take all of these goodies. Awesome. Okay, so let's see here. Um, let's go back into the map and we'll just play for just a little bit longer. Um, let's come in here. And let's come over and go to, let's go to Valentine just for the sake of it. I know it's a little bit of a jaunt, a little bit of a ride. Um, okay, so here we are back in Valentine. And um, I just wanna show you guys here um, look how beautiful this looks. And again, we're still sitting at that good 30 FPS. And the game just looks amazing. The textures, everything, we got textures on Ultra. Um, you know, you can see in there the, uh, the little mud holes uh, that fill up with the water. It's such an awesome touch uh, by the developers. Um, but yeah, we are, uh, we're running solid 30 and, uh, Come on, please, please somebody be generous. game's absolutely beautiful. All right, well, that should about wrap it up. Uh, anyways, if you guys have any questions, you can go ahead and put them in the comments below. Uh, we will answer, um, when we can and, um, uh, if you like this video, like what we do, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. Hit that bell so you're notified um, when we drop new uh, videos. And again, thank you for your support. Um, until next time. Thanks, guys. Game on.